Hi und willkommen zurück. Wir machen den Fight jetzt gleich nochmal. Da wir es letztes Mal schon gesehen haben, skippen wir direkt in den Kampf rein. So und direkt Gehirnantrieb an. Erstmal ordentlich Druck aufbauen. So, was ist denn Modus? Jetzt geht es nämlich schon wieder los. Ich weiß gar nicht, wo ich hin soll. Du bist sowas von dem Arsch, egal wo du hin bist. Tante. Ich muss den seine blöden Elektro-Attacken -Attacken wegkriegen. Der ist richtig Cancer, der Typ. So, jetzt brauche ich nur noch eine Taktik gegen die Tante. Weil die ist richtig eklig. Ich ist schon gut Ach, kann ich auswählen die Tante. Ich meine, die ignoriert halt einfach alles. Die hat gar kein Feedback, wenn ich die angreife. Die läuft halt einfach weiter. Ich fühle mich wie ein nasser Sack. Und die reagiert halt überhaupt nicht drauf. Das ist so lächerlich. Oh nein, jetzt hat sie einen Antrieb drin. Und weglaufen. Luca, ich kann dich nicht hochheben, tut mir leid. Zu gut. Das kannst du vergessen, du kannst hier keinen aufheben. Nicht in dem Modus. Oh, steht schon wieder. Weil hier drinnen aufheben und riskieren, dass die mich trifft, keine Chance. Wie zu riskant. Der heizt sich aber auch in dem Modus hoch, das ist gar nicht gut. So, jetzt. Weg, 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 weg. Jesus ist die Ressourcen intensiv. Weg, 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 weg. Hm. 
Jesus. Oh, jetzt habe ich auch noch den Move verkackt. Out of human heads is crazy. We have to stop them. But Naomi, she needs this. What do you mean? What is this facility for? That's. Uh... <sighs> I can't take this anymore. I'm telling them everything. No, I will. This place is an other research facility run jointly with Spring Pharmaceuticals, just like Arashi said. Human brains of people with powers are being brought here. A portion of them are transplanted into others to turn them into other weapons. The rest are turned into a medical solution to feed the others. That's horrible! Hey, are you really sure about Seiron? I know New Himuka has a lot of its own issues. It's not right that the government monitors everyone and controls all the information. But Seiron causing the uprising, that's just as messed up. Can we really let them get away with transplanting human brains into others or processing the brains into drugs? No, we can't. Obviously. That being said, there are in fact some people who've been forced to accept it. Like my brother. And then there's Kasane. People whose loved ones have been turned into others. They depend on that medication. Human-born others can temporarily regain their senses when they take that medication. Even letting them talk. Does Karin have a family member that's been metamorphosed? No, not a family member. Has Luca or Fabuki mentioned it? Alice? Na, geht's wieder los. Yuito! His brain is... Yuito! Yuito? Is this happening because I used my power? Bist du dann Black aus, oder? My head is killing me. Are you okay? What's wrong? There's something wrong with Yuito's brain. He's beginning to show signs of speech and memory impairment whenever he uses his power. I'm okay now. The pain is fading. Sorry to interrupt, but you need to leave now so we can call this a draw. Hurry up or the others will come. We should leave too. That okay with you, Kasane? Yes. Yuito, our assignment is complete. We should withdraw. Yeah. We should get out of here as soon as possible. Warum klopfen die sich gegenseitig immer zusammen, obwohl sie einfach miteinander reden können? Okay. Uh, sorry. Um, Major General Fubuki sagt. I probably would have taken the ampule too if I were in your shoes. I know saying that won't help with whatever guilt or disgust you might be feeling. Thanks. I'm okay. The medication should be chemically processed, so consider them more like protein or amino acid supplements. It may be unpleasant, but looking at them this way might help you come to terms with it. Yeah, I know what you're saying, but it's just hard for me to do it. I know it might be difficult, but whatever you do, don't throw them up. What? You knew? We... well... we saw it happen. You were outside the hideout. Oh, right. I'm sorry. I know it's not in my stomach anymore, but I just couldn't... It's fine, but you have to fight through it. You can't make it a habit. You're right. Besides, Naomi, it must be so much harder for her. Being turned into another is awful enough, but now she has to... feed on these brains? 
I don't know where she is right now, or how she's doing. When I think about her, I know how much better off I am. If Naomi hasn't given... After you do get through it, he'll be able to help support Naomi when you see her again. Yes. You're right. I... I need to get it together. I'm just wondering if New Himuka is stocking up on those ampules, knowing full well what they're made of. If that's the case, and they do indeed know, then they're going to have to answer to me. No. I have a feeling that New Himuka already knows everything. I just can't get myself to accept it. I'm sorry. Huh? You don't need to apologize. You have nothing to do with the hospital. I know, but I just wanted to apologize. I want to look into the hospital and do something about it. This is a tough position for the both of you. You too, Luca. Everything Karin has done must be hard for you. Sugumi had to see a lot of things she never wanted to as well. I think we've all had our fair share of suffering. But what's important is that we continue to support one another. Yeah. Sorry I worried everyone, and thank you. I want to talk to Luca for a change. I don't know what to tell you, Yuito. Just try not to do everything on your own. And don't push on. If there's too much to handle, let me help Why you pick up the okay? slack. That's what a team is for. Yeah. Thanks, Wataru. Na, dann reden wir halt mal mit Sugumi. Vertrauensepisode. Mal wieder. Oh, Yuito. I would like to talk to you. Hm? What's up, Sugumi? I think I finally found that flower. Look at this. Oh. It's called a silent snowmelt. It's a rare flower that only blooms at high altitudes. Yeah, this is the one. That's incredible. I Leute, ich werde diese Flower Story und diese Vertrauensepisoden skippen, wenn sie nicht von Anfang an interessant sind, weil wenn die über Blumen reden oder so, ja, das interessiert jetzt die wenigsten. Aber ihr könnt mir gerne drunter schreiben, wenn ihr es anders haben wollt in Zukunft. Aber diese Vertrauensepisoden sind mir einfach viel zu stinklangweilig. Chinese Hellsicht, Angriff und Kombovision. Okay. Muss ich mal testen. I understand you a little more. I think I've gotten to know you better too. So, Luca, dann erzähl mir mal wieder, was du für ein Muskelbrot bist, aber ich habe das sicher noch Geschenke, oder? Nee. How have you been feeling lately, Yuito? I'm feeling great. Thanks for asking. Of course. Make sure to rest when you need it. Part of being OSF is taking care of your body. See you around. Are you going to work out now? Yes, my daily routine. Would you like to join me? Light exercise is good for maintaining your health. You're right. Okay, I'll work out with you. Maybe you can make a training program for me. I would be happy to. I promise to make the program that best suits your body type and fighting style. Great, thanks. Ugh, I'm beat. I'm so thirsty. Do you want some water, Luca? <sighs> no, you should drink it. I have this. What is that? A special protein drink that I concocted. It's best to drink it within 45 minutes of exercising. I've never had one. Is it good? I made it strawberry flavored, so it's easy to drink. The intake of protein is essential for building muscle. Not only do you work out, you even worry about your nutrition. Protein is well known to people who like exercise. It's nothing to be surprised about. It's not just that. The program you just went through was pretty hard. You're really stoic about it. Why do you want to train so much? Well, because I'm small. When compared to those around me, I'm always at a strength disadvantage. 
So I want to do all I can to lessen that disadvantage. Sagt der Typ, der mit einem Riesenhammer kämpft. A strength disadvantage. But why does that matter? There's almost no one as good as you in a real fight. You are a Septentrion, and you have top-class strength when it comes to a fight with powers. I do not want to rely solely on my power. Why not? You have an amazing one. I don't see the problem in relying on it. Let me put it another way. Power is something you are born with. It cannot easily be changed. However, muscles are different. The harder you work, the stronger they become. Isn't that amazing? Huh. Um, I guess it does seem pretty amazing, maybe. Yes, you're beginning to understand. Also, my brother is always ahead of me. No matter how much praise I get, I can never equal him. I see. I definitely understand that. Thank you for saying so. Since you are here, I'll tell you my secret. What is it? Wait, just a moment. This is the backpack you always wear. Oh, that's heavy. What's in this? I've made adjustments to my daily routine to train my muscles. I have weights inside my clothes as well. Gewichte in Klamotten, das erinnert, erinnert mich irgendwie an so ein Goku damals. You call them adjustments, but it sounds like torture to me. These extreme methods might be the secret to his strength. Will you put some weights in my clothes too? Of course. They are custom made to be removable. So I will put this here and there you are. Great. Now I'll try to walk. Whoa! Oh, my body is swaying just from moving a little. <laughs> It's not very heavy, but it will be difficult until you are used to using your core. You can borrow them if you like. Now, I'll do another set. You can keep going? Yes, I still have a lot left to do. You can take a rest if you are tired. That's a Septentrion for you. I can't believe he always wears weights. But there's something kind of desperate about the way he's exercising. I feel like he's pushing himself too hard. Can he really handle it? I never expected you to be so odd, Yuito. Huh? Really? I thought I was pretty normal. What is normal in the OSF? It's very intriguing. Teleportation in the Luft und Wächtervision. Okay. I think I'm starting to understand you a little better. Really? I'm so happy to hear you say that. Okay. Ja, ich würde sagen, dann machen wir weiter, oder? Ja. Nächste Phase. I should try to get a little rest. Hat er jetzt wieder ein Blackout? Nö. Nee. Mm -hmm. A message from Major General Fubuki? It's Fubuki. I want an update on your situation. Rendezvous where we met previously. I got a message from Major General Fubuki. Did everyone else get it too? I did. I did too. I think he's talking about the safe zone. He said he's under surveillance. So I am sure he just wanted to play it safe. But Major General Fubuki is with Spring Pharmaceuticals, right? Those ampules. Do you think he knows about that factory? It would be strange if he didn't. He might have a purpose for calling a meeting so soon afterwards. The fact that the OSF hospital prescribed the drugs must mean the government's getting products from that factory in some shape or form. Could Major General Fubuki be the go-between? Does that mean he's an enemy too? Even after everything he's done for us? Hmm. It could just be one of the ways he goes about pretending to obey the government. We can sit here and doubt his intentions all day, but we're better off just asking. You have a big heart, Yuito. Your trusting nature is one of your most likable features. I should really follow your example. It's because he's sincere. I think our skepticism might provide him a nice balance. <laughs> That might be true. Phase 7. Wohin verlorene Erinnerung führen? Okay.
Sorry to call you out here. While I accepted Luca's generous invitation the last time, I feel it would be dangerous for me to frequent your hideout. There's a good chance the team surveilling me will notice. We appreciate your consideration. Wataru told me what happened in Ceyron. I've also given the government a report that won't affect our activities. What? Is that safe? Your family is spring pharmaceuticals. That's precisely why I did. Reporting my own family's wrongdoings only gets the government to trust me more. Besides, Karin and I were the first ones to propose that research facility. What? I think you already know about Alice. She's still being held in that facility as an other. We enticed Ceyron in order to protect her, knowing full well they would abuse their research. The results of which were the ampules and the uprising. We were fools. What's going on with this country? Ceyron may have incited an uprising, but there's still a new Himuka city just like ours. Suo's conducting human experiments, and Ceyron is basically doing the same thing. All of it being done to develop new weapons to fight the threat of the others. One chose to strengthen powers, and one explored a method to control the others themselves. What are others? And I've heard they suddenly began appearing after the Spring of Extinction, but not much is known about them still. That's true. I guess the only other thing we know is that they're created in the Extinction Belt. Some are saying they're wild animals that experience sudden mutations. It's very possible that the government is hiding what they actually are. That is the crux of it. Huh? Even the public can sense something different about the others. So, focusing on that point will nullify the government's personality rehabilitation efforts. Like exposing a government secret to every new Himuka citizen? Just like my brother did in the uprising. Exactly. Karan and I once plotted to send a video of a human at the moment of being metamorphosed straight to the minds of every citizen. But we couldn't find any definitive video to serve as our evidence, and I was hampered after they threatened Karin. So that's why you let the government turn you into a spy? Yes, but now they should have Nagi's data from when Naomi was metamorphosed for research purposes. They took his memory when they subjected him to personality rehabilitation. Now that you mention it, Nagi seemed like he had no idea about Naomi's metamorphosis after he was discharged from the hospital. But, but wouldn't that cause brain damage? Extracting a specific memory is a dangerous process, but that's hardly even a concern to them. You all have the same memory of her metamorphosis, but attempting to digitize and extract it is too risky. That's why we need Nagi's stored memory data. It's already been extracted. We can send the data via Arahabaki to every citizen as proof of the government's inhumane acts. The people are ready to hear it. Can you access it? Yes. I received permission to enter the secure site while you were heading out to Ceyron on your last assignment. I've been provided with a one-time use pass. Nagi's stolen memory. Where is it stored? I think they're storing it in the old OSF hospital you infiltrated before. Mm. I'm sorry for not having more concrete intel. But that facility was used to research powers. It's very likely it's there. Could you infiltrate the old hospital after the platoon has been reorganized? Reorganized? Uh, I forgot about that. I'm... I'm staying in Yuito platoon. This isn't... This isn't the world I want either. I see. So Hanabi is the only one that needs to be transferred. No, I'll stay too. Are you sure? Staying with us could mean being targeted by the government. Then we'll deal with it if it comes to that. After all the awful things we learned, I can't just sit here and do nothing while my friends are trying to do something about it. You don't care if it brings trouble to your family? No. And I'm actually starting to suspect that it wasn't just my uncle who knew, but my... Thank you, Hanabi. Your help means a lot to me. I'll leave you to recover Nagi's memory from Naomi's metamorphosis. I'd like to go myself, but I don't want them revoking my access to Arahabaki, so I have to lay low for now. You've made a lot of waves, Yuito. You need to be careful. This will be your second time infiltrating the hospital. Yes, I will. By the way, I can send you some data to help you bypass the old hospital security system. 
I may not be as good as my sister, but I can still put together a program. Thank you. Oh, jetzt habe ich wieder weggeklickt, sorry. Good luck. Na, nichts Wichtiges. Nur ein neues Programm. I'm with you, Commander Yuito. I'm really glad the whole platoon was able to work as a team. We're all in this together. Was soll denn los? Hä? Ach, da oben. So, was haben wir dann auf der Map noch alles rumliegen? Da ist eine neue Quest oder ist das eine, die man abgeben kann? Ich bin es gerade nicht sicher. Ne, ist ein neuer Quest. Fitnessstudio ist mein Gott. Ist hier noch irgendwo was, wo ich machen kann? Sieht nicht danach aus. Ne? So habe ich eigentlich irgendwelche neuen Herren Nachrichten. Tatsache. Ach so, wegen den Vertrauensepisoden. Okay, da wäre noch eine Vertrauensepisode, aber. Ihr könnt hier gerne pausieren und euch das durchlesen. Das ist jetzt nichts weltbewegendes. Habe ich die Vertrauensepisode tatsächlich einfach übersprungen? Ist hier noch irgendwo Loot? Ich muss jetzt dringend mal zu einem Händler. Ich brauche wieder neues mittleres Gelee. Oder Max Gelee, wenn ich es mir überhaupt leisten kann. Das Zeug ist ja richtig teuer. Ähm. Ach, ich habe ein bisschen was bekommen. Alles gut. Kann sogar neun Stück kaufen, das ist gut. Jetzt muss ich halt irgendwas auch mal wieder verticken. Ne? Da blenden sie halt einfach gar nichts. Gehänfeld aus. Das so. Das ist ja das Zeug, wo ich. Achso, okay. Das ist ausgerüstet. Mein Wurzelblatt. Ist halt... Naja, es wäre für die Vertrauensstufen gut, aber ich will das jetzt nicht unbedingt verticken. Hm. Diese Materialien, was mache ich damit? Ich weiß es bis heute nicht. Ach so, ich kann ja da Waffen mit upgraden. Stimmt ja. Tauschbörse, genau. Jetzt weiß ich es wieder. Lost. Yep, Tausch bestätigen. Na, so komme ich natürlich auch an mein Zeug ran. Das habe ich ganz vergessen. So, was haben wir noch? Metals Fackel. Zwei, zwei plus. Das könnte ich mir sogar beide leisten, ja. Die kann das ja fast komplett hochpushen, what the fuck? Ja, das sind einige ordentliche Upgrades, aber das ist nicht schlecht. Sag ich nicht nein. Aber ich habe jetzt kein Zeug mehr für meine Waffen. Okay, das ist schlecht. Weil sonst könnte ich mir eine bessere Waffe bauen. Nee. Mist. Aber da brauche ich sowieso die Standardwaffe erstmal wieder, um die abzugraden. Oh! 
Kann sie mir nicht leisten. Weil die hat so viel mehr Schaden. Was? So. Ja, ich würde sagen, das schauen wir uns in der nächsten Folge an. Macht's gut. Bis dann. Ciao.